Welcome back to Topless Robot Plays Blazing Chrome. My name is Ryan. I am oh! I am prepared to become Space Dust. <laughs> and and back playing Blazing Chrome. We're and watching, I'm getting my Chrome blazed. We're watching oh! play Blazing Chrome. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I just need that on a loop so I can like trigger it with a button. <laughs> I've got a chaos pad in the other room. Yeah, I, just, do that. I was gonna say, just. <laughs> I've always, you. I've always wanted to have a corny soundboard of dumb shit to play in the middle of anything. Like, so, I'd I was playing uh, Risk of Rain two last night with Modem, and I had just, I, I like, I just bought a chaos pad, a KP three plus. Yep. Mm. And it, those things are so fun. Uh, I would never, I don't think I'd actually ever use it in any real music production. But man, is it a fun toy. Fair. And uh, uh, so, um, Modem has a song that he, at, especially at this point, regrets having made. It's on his SoundCloud. Everyone look for it. SoundCloud.com slash Modem. The name of the song is If You Can't Sing, You Probably Shouldn't. I, I think I have an idea. <laughs> And uh, there, it starts out uh, with him getting a beat together. But the lyrics are, I'm a beautiful crab with sharp little pincers. Do you want me to pinch you? I'll tear off your face. And it's hilarious. And it, inst it became one of my favorite songs of his. It became Damn my it. friend Kyle's uh, uh, favorite songs of his. And we constantly remind him of such. Did you modulate it while you were here? I, I sampled myself singing I'm a Beautiful Crab. Like, I saved it to a, uh, one of the buttons on the sample bank, and every time I leveled up, I hit the, that button. <laughs> yes, torture your friends! <laughs> yes. It is fun. <laughs> hey, Ooh, there spot. we go. Finally, some good news. Well, now you got some Blaster Master. <laughs> That's not how you dodge that. Well, I wasn't sure if I could like, because so like in in uh, in Shinobi Three, I can just like infinite infinitely bounce on some on on enemies until they die. I love these cars that have rocket uh, rockets on their side. Yeah, dude. <laughs> Why, Brooks? I'm not Brooks. trying to. Yeah! There we go. I think this is the checkpoint, I hope. Blaze my chrome ass. Wait, is this the level with the... Yeah. Cool. Yeah, the final boss for this level is... Fuck yeah! <laughs> Best entry ever. And, of course, more fucking killer music. Yes. Yep. Okay, at least you got the checkpoint. Yes. I got the checkpoint, so now I can I can I can move with confidence. Progress. You get to watch this every time you come Yo. into the level. Scream. Boom. So good. Oh yeah. Yeah. Whoever developed this, I don't even know. Is it Devolver? No. <laughs> Another publisher anyway. Yeah, Devolver yeah, doesn't. I, yeah, that's right. Okay. Uh, I just want to say their name again. <laughs> it's just so Devolver, please love us as much as we love you. Please. Oh, shit. I also, you know, we talk about them all the time. I just love them because they also, they shitpost. Like, they're, oh, yeah. they're uh, all of the things they do are funny. But it's always very lighthearted. I don't know. I can. Oh, it looks like Windows Central beat us to the punch. They posted a day ago an article called "Blazing Chrome Xbox One Review: The Best Contra Homage Ever Made." Yep, that's because it is. They're not wrong. Developer Joy Masher. Any other entries of note? Uh, let me see. Oniken. And... Say Boniken or Oniken. Oh my god! Oh my god! It looks like they've got a new game coming out called Moonrider. Moonrider? That looks like Cyber Ninja Contra. Okay. Oh, you have, speed you have my attention. Uh, it's the same sort of style. It's, it's that. 
and I am kind of instantly stoked on it, considering how well this game controls. Yes, I want. I just looking at this, I want. Oh, it. so so that that's their Shinobi game. Yeah. Because <laughs> so I keep I keep reading this, and I'm just like, I'm just like, yeah, you know, the Shinobi game. It's it's gonna be cool. You son of a bitch. <laughs> How do I get- I don't even get that. You know what, I'm just gonna- It's, it's so gonna... rare to hear a legitimate ah! frustration from Brooks like that. Ah! I, see, I, you may have wanted to kill these people as you were going. <laughs> Out! Alright, Mega Man Zero. And Odalis, the Dark Call. I don't know anything about Odalis. And Oniken. So Adele is the Dark Call and Onikin are games that they have released. And it looks like Moonrider is coming up. Okay. And the Blazing Chrome just came out recently. All of them are developed by uh, Joy Masher, which is apparently Dominic Ninmark. Well, uh, I, I hope... Is a Gundam going to pop out of this fucking train? <laughs> <laughs> I hope that they get uh, some recognition and or better publicity. Because yeah. they, uh, they this make... This game rules. This is fucking rad. Oh, they're Brazilian. Hell yeah. That might be part of why it's been difficult for them to get some good publicity out there. Yeah. At least, at least in our market. Yeah. Watch everyone in Brazil is playing this game right now. <laughs> yeah, right. It's like, we can't... Gee, damn it. I mean, Brazil is a pretty big uh, gaming uh, audience. Like, there are, there are a lot of Brazilian gamers. Yeah, it, but it, it, it's, I, and maybe this is just because I only get, like, a glimpse into it, but the only time I ever hear about uh, Brazilian gamers, they play competitive community games, and everyone who isn't from Brazil hates them. <laughs> ah. Like, it's, it's a joke for people to just type BR question mark, because that's what they do. They join really? a lobby and they just ask, like, is anybody else from Brazil is what that means. Yeah, that's it. Huh. Oh, hell yeah. And usually, <laughs> this is just, they're usually very, uh, very rude in competitive games when, like, they're on your team. Really? It's, and not that most people aren't. Most people who play games competitively are, are usually assholes. I was going to say, there's a reason that I don't usually play games online. But the, the Brazilians are particularly rude. Um, for whatever reason. Hmm. It's great, though, because I don't understand Portuguese, so I don't know what they're saying to me. <laughs> <laughs> you just know that they're being rude. Yeah, yeah I know. you can hear it in their, uh, in their inflection. <laughs> they're not happy. <laughs> There's also certain words you start to uh, pick up on what they mean, because you hear them a lot. <laughs> sure. <laughs> and context clues give you an idea of, oh, shit, now I know how to swear in Portuguese. <laughs> yes. Contra clues. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> yeah, I am gonna have to keep an eye out for Moonrider. I don't know if it's out now Damn or it. what. It um, keeps giving me that laser weapon, so and I'm. That is one thing I don't like: is that when it gives you a gun, it auto equips it. I wish yeah. it didn't do that. The, um, also, the laser weapon, if you tap it. Yeah, you can you can pulse it. But the, the real power is definitely in the fucking Kamehameha. Oh, if, absolutely. Just, just get a little tap tap. Get a little tap, uh, I, knew tap. You, I knew you were a fan of Dragon Ball. <laughs> we're <laughs> that half of the entire podcast. <laughs> Dragon Ball Z is my favorite anime. <laughs> Give it to me! Oh. <laughs> Damn it. You get too greedy. That's what's uh, what's gonna happen to you. Greed, greed is good. Someone's been watching Wall Street. I've never actually seen it. <laughs> what? A oh, film I have oh. not seen. I know. I know. Oh, oh, come on, on me, Nanda. <laughs> Stupid ninja robot. Yeah, they... I hope that this studio keeps on these... Like, it seems like they have a real good handle on 
what made these games great. Oh, now you're doing the Dan. That's how Dan got through that section, too. Yep. You don't want to cut your losses. Good lord! So they all die, though. They all die right here. You gotta open the door first. You know? <laughs> you know? It's times like this, I remember, that I'm just gonna keep going until I go insane. <laughs> I will happily be a bit crushed voice actor for this game. Dude, I would. <laughs> being a bit crushed. Anything that's bit crushed just sounds great. <laughs> it always makes me laugh. Oh! And not even to say, like, anything serious that's related to the game. I would just love to say dumb shit and have it bit crushed into the game, yeah, you know? Right. Like. Just be, be some. Some weird enemy or whatever where, like, is is dying words or something is some bit crushed. I went my pee! <laughs> I think I left the stove on! <laughs> <laughs> you look really pretty today! <laughs> Sweet Oho! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Enemies that compliment your look as they're dying. <laughs> I'm glad I died to you! <laughs> Pretty sweet track, huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, now I want that game to be made where all the enemies are are just because it's a labor of love <laughs> to make this just fun for you. Yep. So they hope that you're enjoying yourself as they're dying. <laughs> Oh shit. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Uh, oh, I can't go back. Ah! <laughs> Damn it, I was gonna oh, be like, oh, Brooks. I can back in that life now. <laughs> oh, Brooks. You know, I'm getting better though every time. Are you? Yeah, I had, sure? I had all three, all, I had all three weapons. <laughs> I had all three weapons at, at the present, at, at my death. Inventory management's important. <laughs> well, uh, so you're getting very good at one aspect of this game. Take that, you some bitch. Is that quite sweet? <laughs> 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 Weapons of mass destruction. Yeah, I went. <laughs> I, I, I was hoping you were going somewhere with that. It's uh, it's uh, uh it's 2005 again, people. <laughs> Damn it. Brooks, you have to recognize the pattern. I am recognizing the pattern. Not it's very my well. <laughs> I did not have sexual relations with that oil field. <laughs> never gonna get oh. that life! Yeah, you'll never get it. Just stop trying. Yeah, <gasps> yeah. Sweep! You know... I thought Brooks would be better at this. I did too. I really did. Uh oh! Uh, the, the backwards hat turned, turned around. <laughs> now he means business. <laughs> Sorry, it's time to get serious. It's time to get serious. Brooks okay, is getting so angry. We don't play with the D-pad. <laughs> yeah, I thoroughly look forward to more games from this company. Oh yeah. Same, dude. A game like this can kick my ass. That old school difficulty. It's like I don't I don't feel cheated. And it's not. Uh, too much that old school difficulty, which I appreciate. It is, um, 
because Infinite con- continues that uh, start you back from the checkpoint. Yeah. It's just the right amount of uh, punishment. He's gonna gun me down like that, huh? I'm here for my punishment, sir. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> Punish me, daddy. <laughs> <laughs> Punish me, senpai. Okay. <laughs> and then he did. <laughs> you know what? No. Stop trying. Don't. I wasn't even trying. I'm uh. just trying to j- j- move across. Oh, Brooks. The boy. All right. The hat is off. This is why it's obstructing my, my, uh, my, uh, the it's, real. <laughs> it's blocking your chakras, dude. It's blocking my chakras and disrupting my flow of feet. And the, re- <laughs> <laughs> the real game kid has arrived. He's now channeling the alien spirits into his brain. Via mega waves. <laughs> oh, oh. oh my god. Yeah. Oh. Brooks, I thought you were a real gamer, TM. You know what? I am a real gamer, TM. <laughs> Brooks, I thought you were gonna be the one. <laughs> Nothing personal, kiddo. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. What? Yes. Don't let it blind you to tactics. You mean like shooting and basic running around? Yes. Well, you haven't been doing very well at those things so far, so... No, I've not. <laughs> no. Nope. Truth be told, I was never actually all that good at Contra. Well, you gonna learn. I mean, I'm certainly playing better than average. Uh, than As my... he dies, that was, that was great timing. Yeah. Again, <laughs> classic hubris. Better, better, better than, than, uh, than average in my lifetime. <laughs> uh, for sure. Which sucked because Contra Hardcore is so fun. I had to cheat to get through that game. <laughs> I think everyone had to cheat in Contra. Yep. Well, I mean, I feel like a code, the Contra code is just just invites invites one. Up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, you know, start. You know, I, I wonder if there's a, such a code in this. I would not put it past them, considering how good an homage this is. I just keep forgetting that I can crouch. <laughs> that's that's a key element. I also don't notice you using the aiming function very often. <laughs> the second that he does, he dies. It's perfect for moments like this. <laughs> so now combine the two, aiming and ducking. Not at the same time, obviously, but... You know, like DDR. Aim. Left. Duck. Right. You know, I've always wondered this talking about like DDR. I never actually knew what this game was called, but it was the equivalent of DDR, but it was all hand motions. What, what the fuck was with that game? Have you ever seen that one? Oh, the one where you have to like put the hands out and it goes through sensors? Yeah. It's not like you're uh, hitting, you're not yeah, hitting anything. Yeah, it's going through a sensor, going through, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I feel like it's, it's like above and below the, the sensor pad. Yeah. Uh, it's some Japanese thing, I think. Like, <laughs> I didn't no talk surprise about it cause, to me there. Because I've seen it in some like TV show. I've seen it before, but I don't remember the context. Actually, I may have seen it at GameWorks. A uh, long time ago. I saw it at Golfland years ago. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh. Hmm. I, th- I think I think I, I know the machine you're talking about. All right. <laughs> now that I re- remember to aim. <laughs> yeah, sometimes when you watch... When someone's really good at DDR, it's kind of impressive to watch. When someone's really good at that game, it just looks stupid. Cause it, I feel like just when like someone's fun. really good at DDR, it looks stupid because they're just resting back on the on the bar that's behind you know behind the pads. Yeah, and tap tip tippy tappy tappy tip with but, their tip. But some of the leg stuff. motions are fun to watch and like calculated. Some of them, yeah, and some of them lead to like almost dance like patterns. Yeah, and it's not that the moves to the hand gesture game aren't calculated because obviously they are. Sure. It's just it doesn't look cool at high levels. It just looks stupid. <laughs> it looks like they're doing the, the cabbage, the mashed potato or whatever, the <laughs> yeah, cabbage patch yeah, or yeah. whatever the fuck. Whatever it is. 
Can you mash potato? Can you do the twist? Just a little bit longer, Bruce. You just need to duck a little, a little bit longer. Just a little bit. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> What is that? He's punching you with electric. He's keeping you energized to go fast. He's he's doing a running motion. Oh, is that a speed bot? Yeah, yeah. speed bot. That's amazing. Yeah, I had never noticed that. Once more into the breach, dear friends. <laughs> well, Bruce. <laughs> You know, I'm, I'm almost having as much fun as you guys are. Are you sure? Yeah, it's like, even though, yeah, I, I admittedly suck at this. Um, it's okay. It was a charge beam. That was a prime melee opportunity. You were charging your laser. Yeah. Laser. See, the reason that we think this went below, like, under everyone's radars is every single achievement we've gotten in this game has been a rare achievement. Every yeah. single one. Uh, um, uh, that means I'm good, right? <laughs> yes, yes, for sure. Uh -huh. yep, to totally. <laughs> yup. Yeah, sure. It just means that a lot of people, it's <laughs> in Game Pass, a lot of people installed it, and maybe even fired it up. But no one played. This isn't Fortnite. Yeah. Fortnite. More like short night. Am I right? <laughs> Got him. Got him. Zing. Ding, ding, do. I think I am going to have to give Brent shit for playing Fortnite. Yeah, I noticed that he was playing Fortnite. And I think that uh, Brent deserves shit for uh, playing Fortnite. You're talking about Brent? Yeah. Like my Brent? Yeah. Yeah, yeah he is. But, you know, he's also an uncle. Who plays Fortnite? <laughs> yeah, yeah. He's, the, I, uh, he's he, also he's the cool uncle, I guess. Run, run. He's also a real gamer. <laughs> a real gamer, TM. TM. The gamerist. Z. TM. Hey, we haven't seen this boss in a long time. We're not gonna Just see him for a long time. Don't even bother shooting at him there. Just dodge the disc. Never mind. What is this, Tron Deadly Discs? Do I continue? You yes, do. of course, obviously. Continue. Eight, seven, six, five. Live and let die. <laughs> Rebel one. <laughs> Let's rock. Big Apple, 3 a.m. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it! Scream! <laughs> Come on! Brooks is going to actually re, huh? <laughs> so, uh, Brooks, uh, yeah, I I'll, got it. <laughs> I'll give you, I'll give you, uh, you, you get to, uh, you get lifelines. Oh, I can ask for a lifeline. Yeah. Oh, okay. So, and that would be uh, handing off to uh, me or Dan. What if the lifeline stipulated that Dan could use the use the joypad and you had to use the buttons? I think that we'd no. both still do just fine. <laughs> we, I don't think we would get very far. Oh, you mean the two of us together? Together, yeah. Oh. Yeah, you have to simultaneously. Oh. That'd be that'd be way too punished. Yeah, but uh, it'd make yeah, you look really be... good. <laughs> Better oh, than two actually, people be playing easy. the same controller! <laughs> that would be pretty easy for me on the buttons. Would not be for me at all, because I plan all my actions out in tandem. Like, I, I, I don't know. I, I don't think I could do it. Uh, not, not without, like, hours of practice prior to doing it. Like, comment, and subscribe if you want to see me and Dan try and pull control a single controller in in a contra like. Run! As, you know, if as, as long as you're okay with watching us play the first couple minutes of the game over and over again, cool. <laughs>
So yeah, don't worry about shooting the damn things because you can't hit the damn thing. Just dodge that damn things. Woo! Ooh. I said dodge. Dip, dive. Dodge, duck, dip, dive, dive. and dodge. Yeah. There you go. Whoa! Whoa. Down, down, down! Let's try, let's try it. it was good, though. It was good. Right? No. All right, mm. I, I will use a lifeline very shortly. Because <laughs> this intro is rad as fuck, but man, I'm a little... Yeah, I'm sure people are tired of seeing this part of the level over right. and over again. And we don't edit down our game yeah. footage. What you see is what we play. Yeah, yeah and this, we're, we're not a bunch of posers. This is the we're gamers TM. This is the true essence of playing a game like Contra anyway. I get yeah. it. You know, you want to see someone kick ass and everything, but you play Contra? Yeah. You're going to see the same part over and over again for a while. Yeah. Unless, also, unless you are a real gamer, if TM. You, if you like watching people kick ass at everything, why are you watching us? Yeah. yeah. Unless you're watching me play Mega Man! <laughs> oh, I can't wait. I cannot wait. I cannot wait for Mega Man Zero. To take me down a peg? Because I, I don't know it? No, it's to see you ri rise to that challenge. Rise up. No. 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 <laughs> no. We don't say that anymore. It's not, it's not a risk. It's not a... <laughs> We're very close to living in, a, in an era where saying gamers rise up is actual terrorist propaganda. <laughs> yep. What is the origin of that anyway? I just heard all of a sudden uh, started hearing people make fun of it, but I've never heard it said in earnest. Uh, I haven't heard anyone say it unironically, although the people who do say it unironically are, you know, anonymous basement dwellers, usually. Oh, so this is an anonymous thing. I don't thing. think it's, no, I'm just saying, like, I, I don't think it's an anonymous thing. I think a lot of people who would like to pretend they are anonymous uh. would, uh... Oh, yeah. Would say gamers rise up. I bought a guy fox mask on Amazon for $9. I'm so tired of Chad taking my lunch buddy because he knows I like Fortnite. <laughs> well, you just let it happen. Wonder how many V-Bucks I could get for this snack pack. <laughs> oh! Damn it. The V-Bucks become the new schoolyard currency. <laughs> then Epic Games will... Okay, back to dodging. Ducking, dipping, diving, and dodging. What were the first and last Ds? <laughs> Dodge. <laughs> <laughs> Dodge. You missed two of the it's, most important Ds. It's Doge. All right, it's been a hot minute. Watch Dan play this game because when a a lifeline has been used. Dan's Russian, where Brooks is fear to tread. Dan's Russian. <laughs> I mean, he does have a Rasputin ass beard, but Dan is not Russian. Ra ra. Rasputin. Hey, no fair. He's using a turbo button. <laughs> <laughs> I love the turbo button, it's so bad. No fair, he's using a power glove. Wow, your mom lets you use two controllers? <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ, <laughs> dude. That that is super annoying. Uh having um uh the weapon auto equip like that. Yes. Yeah. It really fucks with my flow. I have an intense dislike for it. Get good noob. That's uh that's why I'm doing so poorly. <laughs> but that is why that is you know the that sole, is why I'm just so distraught reason. at that minor flaw in an otherwise wonderful game. Also, you know what's great is that this soundtrack is not trying, to, trying to be like remember the '90s. It's no. just like hey, what? it's a soundtrack. Well, like 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 uh. What's his name? Ollie Ollie Wright or Ollie Ride, the guy that does the stuff with uh, FM eighty four and the Midnight and stuff like that, isn't gonna have a single with, with this track. Oh yeah. Not that I don't love that man's voice. It is perfect. Well, 
I'm not gonna get him in one. Very we, close. Though. No quick kill. You got him flashing. Oh, it's getting spicy in here. You know, I would have, I would have been able to do that. Yeah. At least you very smartly uh, changed over your weapon. Yes. Oops, that's the same mistake I made last time too when I was playing this game. That laser lasts a little longer than I think it does. And there it is. We did it. <laughs> we did it. <laughs> Yay! Now it's. Uh, uh, would you like to get back on the reins, Brooks, or should I keep going? Yeah, I'll get back on the reins. All right. Do it up. So, in the next episode, Brooks has used one life, uh, one lifeline. One life to live. One life to live! Oh, shit. Uh, in the next episode, Brooks is continuing playing Blazing Crow. Blah. See you next time. Thanks for watching. Is this your card? Subscribe if it is.